Hi, everyone. My name is Joey Chu. I am the artist illustrator for the book, Kindergarten, where kindness matters every day. And it's really nice meeting you guys. And thanks for having me. Um, today, I would like to start with doing like a little drawing demo of the main character, Leo, in the book. So let me share my screen real quick. I usually starting with a rough drawing of the character. I start with uh, Leo's big head. Usually when the drawing kids, proportionally, the head is much larger than adult. And then here's Leo has a nice curly hair, almost like a lion's mane. And don't worry, about, don't worry about having a drawing to be perfect because be really loose because once you put the color in, you don't really see the line anymore. Um, and for Leo, I do the cross where the center of the face is and Leo has a really big eyes. And big eyebrow. I draw his nose, mouth, neck. The smaller size body for his first day of kindergarten. And this is it for his hoodie. Arms and Hands and feet. And since I'm doing digitally, you can do this in your iPad or um, Photoshop, or you can also do just do paper and uh, color pencil. Um, so digitally, we can make the line to be much lighter using it as the guide. And now I'm going to be adding color or start with the uh, Leo space. So this is his skin tone. I like to be a nice bright orange. And then adding his ear. Again, keeping everything very loose. And then add a little bit of his neck. And usually the next thing I do is actually adding a little bit of blush color. So around the ear, the cheek, as well as the nose area, I added a little bit more color for him. And then now I'm adding the facial feature, starting with his eyes. He has a nice big brown eyes. A bit darker for his eyebrow. And for his nose, I tend to do a little bit dark red. And then just kind of blend it in a little. Uh, and then adding the tiny nostrils. Horse for his mouth. Uh, I'm thinking maybe making his smile open so you can see his teeth. Maybe a little lighter. A 
a nice pink color for his mouth. And then for his tongue, it's a slightly darker pink. And then for his teeth, it's white. So now you can kind of see his face is appearing. Um, next thing I would do is his hair, which is something similar to his eye color, but just a slight dark. And since he has a nice curly hair, see, I'm not exactly following my line art. I'm just playing around because hair is something that's could be nice free, free flowing. So it's kind of a lion's mane type of curly hair. behind his ear. And sometimes I like to use a slightly different variations of the brown, maybe a bit lighter and lower the opacity and just kind of blend it into the hair. So the hair will have a slight different texture and adding a little bit darker parts so it doesn't being so flat. Maybe we can add a, a few more strings here and there. Hair, that's his hair. Now we can do his uh, outfit. So in the book, he has a blue t shirt underneath. Since he has a big heart, we're going to add a big heart graphic inside. Kind of represent the kindness. And I'm adding his green jacket. In the beginning of the book, uh, Leo tends to have his hoodie up because he was shy and worried about and being scared. And then towards the end of the book, he took his hoodie up so he can show his entire face to everybody. And then for the hoodie, we'll have a two little string coming off. Now I'm doing his jeans, blue jeans, slightly darker. He wears a pair of purple sneakers. And then I'm adding a little bit of light detail to make it show that it's more of a sneaker. Lastly, will be his hand, by finger for each. And then you can either erase or just turn off the, the line art part. Uh, and then you can check on your drawings. I also like to make the hand 
the fingertips slightly warmer so it looks less flat and maybe let's add a little shadow under the neck this way this way his face is nice and round so here you go here's like a little demo drawing and how i drew leo for the book Hope you guys like it.